Hello everyone. Hope this check-in check -in finds everyone well. Before spring break begins, we have Module 3 at our midterm. Module 3, Civilizations, Kingdoms, and Empires will be our last module before the midterm exam is posted in Blackboard. I trust you're all caught up on lectures and films that I've posted thus far. As for the double entry journal, you should be reading and journaling weekly. If you're still unsure as to what is expected of you, please revisit the criteria and know that you can always send me a sample of your work. You should also see the submissions from your fellow classmates from last week's coursework. If you have yet to submit yours due to uncertainty, please just go ahead and do so, for it's far better to post something rather than nothing. This is a very liberal assignment as I want you to reflect not only on direct coursework that we're doing, but any indirect material that you may run across or seek out. In the end, I feel it's so important to hone your writing craft while at the same time working African American African history. Excuse me. Please note that we'll be having our midterm exam on March 4th, 2020, before spring break starts. It will be posted at 11.59 on March 4th, 2020. It will be due back in Blackboard by 11.59 on March 13th, 2020. Please note that I'm extending the exam deadline to Friday, 3.13, 2020, when our spring break formally begins. The midterm will be in two parts. Terms. You will have about 20 terms. You choose to define five terms and state their significance, and you could also do two more terms for extra credit. Then the essay portion. You'll have about five to six essays to choose from. You can do one grand essay or two smaller essays. I also allow for extra credit essays. The midterm will most, like, most definitely cover the films that we viewed thus far, my PowerPoints, and our online themes and topics. There will not be anything in your readings as our books cover, book covers the 15th century and beyond. Plus, you're to be journaling on those readings, and that is where I expect you to work the reading aspect of our course. Please find our post-spring break schedule. It should go as follows, barring major catastrophe. By all means, for you to continue your reading and writing, as well as finishing viewing all the videos we've screened thus far. Everything that we've done should be in the in what we've done so far content area. 3-13-2020, spring break begins. 3-22-2020, spring break, break ends. And then once you finish your midterm exam, I will want to know what your formal decision with regard to either taking the final examination or reading Ngugi's work and then writing your critical review of Weep Not Child. Module 4, Africa since 1500 CE, begins March 24th, 25th, 2020 at 1159. Then you'll have that for two weeks. Module 5, Colonialism and African Resistance, begins April 7th to 8th, 2020 at 1159. You have that for two weeks as well. Then Module 6, Independence and Beyond, April 21st to April 22nd, 2020 at 11.59 p.m. You'll have that for two weeks and beyond. And then that will run right into the double entry journals that are due 5-1-2020. Final exam will be posted on 5-8. And then the final exam or your writing um, comparative writing project is due on 5-15, um, not 2019, at 2020. i got to change those. Again, be sure to check BBC Africa and CNN Africa periodically, as there are many happenings that you should be aware of. Um, maybe it's a bit premature, but have a grand spring break wherever you end up. And as always, if there's anything I can do to make your learning experience better, do not hesitate to let me know.